Hi everyone. So following the uh, review of the first of the Inferior Devices um, books, it's time to announce what the next book in my um, book challenge is going to be. Now obviously I'm reading a series of books so that means that um, I can't just pick a, a book from my jar of uh, book titles for the year. I have to start on the next one of the series which um, I'm really looking forward to, to, to reading. Um, if you want to have a look at my review that I did of the, the first book, I mean yeah, I absolutely loved it um, and I'm really looking forward to starting the next book which which is always good because obviously you don't want to have a series where you read the initial book and go oh I'm not too sure about this but I I really did like it. So instead of going to the jar, I can simply hold up the book I'm going to be reading next, which is the book two of the Infernal Devices called The Clockwork Prince. Um, so as I explained in my review of the previous book, um, the the Infernal Devices are the prequels to the Mortal Instruments series by Cassandra Clare um, and they follow a girl called Tessa in Victorian um, London who has discovered um, some things about herself. I'm not going to say what because that'll be spoiler to uh, for book, the previous book if you haven't read it and if you want to read it so I won't reveal absolutely everything um, but I'll just quickly read a, the back of the book. Um, I haven't actually looked at the back of the book so hopefully this won't spoil much for this. Have a look. Right, in the magical underworld world of Victorian London, Tessa Gray finds her heart drawn more and more to Jem whilst her longing for will continues to unsettle her. Confining the Magister free will from his secrets and give Tessa the answer to who she is and what she was born to do? Let's find out. Um, <laughs> this is book two or three, just so you know. So obviously because it's three books, I don't think that Tessa's necessarily going to learn absolutely everything because there's still another book to go. But yeah, I really, I'm really, i really looking forward to, to reading this, finding out what's going to happen to Tessa. And especially, um, as I said in my review of the previous book, finding out what's going to be happening to Jem, because I absolutely love Jem. Um, so yeah, so I'm going to be starting on that uh, first thing tomorrow morning. Um, and I will be back soon with a video uh, reviewing this this book. So another one looking really, really looking forward to. So uh, I'll see you later.